Each of our live stream cameras renders to a render target at all times when it's in the scene. So if you have a few of them, it's, it will slow down your frame rate. So if you don't need to simultaneously stream from different viewpoints, then you can set up a simple teleport system, which will allow you to switch between the shots with only one live stream camera in the scene. So we need to create a camera actor for each of the different viewpoints. Drag the camera actor into the scene and set up the view that you want, and then snap object to view. Go on to a different view. Drag another camera actor. And we'll just find a third viewpoint. and drag in another camera actor. Okay, so now I've got these three different camera actors in place for each of the different shots that I want. Go to your level blueprint. We need to create a reference for each of the cameras. So just select it in the world outliner, then right click, create a reference to your live stream camera and then do this for each of your camera actors. Just right click and then create a reference. Then drag out from the live stream camera and type attach, attach actor to actor and change these to snap to target and copy and paste for each of the cameras. And next, connect the camera actors to the parent actor slot and connect the live stream camera to the target. Then we want to be able to trigger each of these views using the keyboard. So right click and type one. So when we press one, it will trigger this camera viewpoint one, two, and three. So we can use one, two, and three to switch between each of the shots. Compile. Then press play. And then when you click in the viewport and press one, they get camera view one and two and three. So now I'm just switching between each of my shots using one, two, and three.